I'm so excited. I'm so excited, y'all. Get ready with me. Let's go. Hey, friends. Hey, family. Cool. Estas bienvenidos. You need your pick. That's all I have to say. In today's video, we are going to do the takedown of the Melanin Twist Elongating Style Cream. And I'm kind of scared. But don't be scared. <laughs> Um, I am using the melanin oil. I have used this in my hair and as you can tell in the clip when I was actually twisting my hair, it looked very, very nice. It was very shiny. I immediately love this oil and um, I I just, I really like the packaging on this. Let's, let's talk about it. I love the spout. She did an amazing job because I was able to use this as a massage oil for my hair. And so I was able to go ahead and go in and, you know, put it into the scalp. I do love that the spout that comes on it locks it in. And so, but we're going to use this to take down our twist as well. I'm just going to put a couple of drops in my hand and I'm going to close this right back up because we don't want anything to spill. It has a nice herbal scent and y'all know with takedowns. We want to like rub them all throughout the twist and let's time lapse this so it's not forever, but um, yeah, let's do it. Okay, guys. Okay. Sorry about that. I had a call I had to take. But this is the end result of the elongating cream. Um, so far, so good. We'll see how it works. And then how many days this will last before I have to wash again. I definitely need a good trim but that has nothing to do with how this cream is going to perform one of the things I'm trying to remember too is to use my pick the more you use your hands the frizzier it'll get because of the oils that mix and just friction but this helps with reducing frizz so I like how that looks so far I'm gonna do my edges like how that you is looking so far so yeah we will see how it works and I will come back and I'll probably show you in the next couple of days before I decide to do a wash day how it looks so yeah this is the takedown after two days of a wash and go converting it into a wash and go from a wash and go and um, yeah I like it so far so far but we haven't been in an element so we'll we'll come back okay Hey guys, so this is my hair after this is day two of a twist out using the melanin elongated twist cream. I'm going to have to try this again because I noticed that I am trying a gel and the gel has glycerin in it. It's all the way down, but my hair can pick up any form of glycerin and I do not like the way my hair has turned out if you notice some of the curls are deformed I mean deformed are very formed but other ones are going straight and I think it's because of the heaviness of the shea butter it's really weird that shea butter and coconut oil these are heavy oils or olive oil is a heavy oil but shea butter it does something to my hair and leaves a cast on my hair and I think it's the shea butter I don't even know if it's it's definitely it feels frizzier than normal, but I can feel the cast. And there's like product buildup that I can just feel on my hair. I think when using this, if you have fine thin hair, this is probably the only thing that needs to go on your hair. So I'm going to try it a few more times and show you guys what the results are. But this is how it looks. A 
future Melissa here, future editing Melissa rather. Um, I just didn't want to leave the video of you just guys seeing you guys see my hair and how frizzy it was and on second day hair. As you can tell, this was not a successful test drive, but I wanted to share with you guys a couple of things. This is how I test products, just so you know. I will test it with a couple of things that I'm trying and then I will try it with things that I already like just to see if it will fit in my routine. I highly recommend you do things like that because you may like a product, but if it's not working with what you already love, then it may not be beneficial for your hair routine. You know what I'm saying? So I wanted to share with you guys, this is a new product that I am, a new product to me. It may not be new on the market, but this is the Cantu Shea Butter Maximum Hold Moisture Retention Gel. And so this one actually has shea butter and olive oil in it which is a testament did not realize that I was having heavy oil on top of heavy oil this is what I used in the wash and go and if you guys watch my videos you know that I convert my wash and goes to a twist out so it was like way too heavy and this may be the reason this is the reason why I test the product more than once I try to test it a couple of different times and uh, sometimes that's why I don't give videos right out to you as quickly as you would like me to just because I like to test it with a couple of different things so the test that you just saw was a, it was a miss and it was probably because both of these had that one has mango butter and shea butter in it this one has shea butter and olive oil all heavy oils and I did say that my hair felt heavy and I'm sure this is the that was the reason so that's the reason why I'm testing the product again before I come with the definitive answer I may change my mind I might need to use it by itself um, which I do talk about because of how heavy heavy the products are so just test your products just I, I don't recommend you just saying right off the bat hey I don't like this I don't like it there have been so many times that I have tried a product and end up liking it because I found the way that works for me. So sometimes the first way that you use the product may not work. And then look at the ingredients. If the product, especially if you're high porosity, that might be a one-step lock method product. When I mean what I mean by that is because it's a styling cream that also has heavy oils, that might be the only thing that you need to apply to your hair in order to get a good tw tw uh, a good twist out you might want to use a glycerin free leave-in and then use that product which um, the twist all like um, elongating cream does have glycerin in it so if you're not extremely glycerin sensitive then that might be a product that you could use but um, I, like I said I'm gonna try it a couple of times I just wanted to come on and share some tips and some things with you in this video and um, I hope you guys have a great day still testing and then I'm going to come with a review of the whole entire hair care system from Melanin Hair Care. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you in another Maintenance Monday. <laughs> Bye.